guys, so I've got some super exciting news. I wrote to a paranormal investigation team, um, the one that actually investigated my house. I wrote to them a few days ago and they finally got back to me um, about joining their team on an investigation. And they called me yesterday and just said, hey, like we're doing this daytime investigation um, on Sunday, do you wanna come? And it's for some brewery in Norwich. I'm not sure if it's these guys or if it's Epicure. I'm not sure, but it's one of those. Um, apparently, the place is super haunted. So I'm going to be joining the team. I asked Ed, um, the what, who I'm guessing is the, the lead investigator, I asked him if it was okay that I videotape it for YouTube. And he said, yeah, sure, no problem. Um, but I don't really want to be videotaping like our greeting like meeting him and his team um i think his team is a little apprehensive about bringing new people on because apparently they had some some guy who was a total phony or a couple people who were total phonies and like faked personal experiences and things like that um that's not me i'm in this for real like i am down to hunt some ghosts and if there are no ghosts I'm not gonna pretend that there are. I just think it's super cool um, being able to go with a team that's around this area and a team who has equipment and a team who has a camera crew and everything like that so I'm gonna see how it goes. Um, I'm gonna try to vlog most of it. I'm just gonna have to feel out like you know what they're comfortable with um, in terms of me filming. Without any further ado, then let's hunt some ghosts. We are at Epicure Brewery. That's why we want to get in ASAP before the club starts. It is. It's a nice order out. Watch what you want in Santa Claus. This is Michelle. She's holding a camera. Sarah's holding another camera. Tony's got an audio and he's got EMF devices. These things will light up if you touch it. Tony's unit will light up if you go up to it. This audio and the one Tony's holding, you can speak into to validate you are here. And as I said, we're leaving in an hour. We don't want to harm you. We don't want to inconvenience you, but we'd really like to let the owners know who you are. If you're here, you don't have to be afraid of us. What happened? I said, who'd you? Someone. No, I heard someone. Like, really? I thought it was you. Um, I started to say something and something spoke. And, I, and he wasn't no, even was moving from like that. I thought maybe it was another suite, but he was standing still. I was around to get money. That was horrible. Was that somebody just trying to identify themselves? Because Michelle heard it as well. I don't know if either you guys caught it. I, I saw you react for sure, both of you. So whatever it was, was over this one, because nobody heard it. Yeah. Tom, you didn't hear that when I stopped, did you? So it must have been over by us, Michelle. Okay. This painting was mounted on the wall. Okay. I just want to check and see if... You can see the mounting that's there. Curious to know it. For one minute, I just want to see where you want to go with it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just for shits and giggles. <laughs> Is there anybody here or who might work here that you take an interest to? You know what? I didn't even think of that premise. Possibly. Tom, are you here a lot? <laughs> <laughs> Is there a particular person that's here every single time when it happens? Yeah, where, where did Jason go? Hey, Jason. Um, does the activity always happen around you, or are you... No, they, they didn't. I've never seen it all off of the 
So wait, so you've seen a few things. Jukebox comes on. And there's two other owners? Yeah, no, I've, there's six of us total. Six of us. Have uh, all six of you had things happen? At least five of us. Okay. Seven. Do you need help at all? Are you stuck here? That's all I want to know. Did you catch that? What was that? There was one syllable and it sounded kind of high pitched and we're yeah. like, Ooh. Yeah, what was that? Did you hear that, Michelle? Was that one of okay, you guys? Tony, did you hear that? So it was right I definitely here. heard it. It was right here. And that sounded to me either childlike or female. That was, that was good because I saw you look at me right when it went whoop. Yeah. And it, wasn't that it? Whoop. Yeah, no, of course. So what we're going to do, guys, we've got another half an hour or so here. We're going to start with Sarah, and then we're going to go with Michelle, Tony, and myself. We're going to spend like five minutes in this dark room. Yes. And maybe if you feel a little more comfortable with just one of us in, in private, we're going to put the recorder in there. We're going to put the REM pod in there. Mm. And the rest of us are going to go away from this area and just let someone stand in here and try to get your attention. So Sarah's going to go in there first. You're just going to ask questions. Okay. I'm going to shut the door. Yep. And I'm going to give you about five minutes just to see. Maybe there's one person in particular. Plus, they'll be really quiet in here for audio. And hopefully gotcha. that camera won't fall. Okay. <laughs> It's just me and you now. Now that I'm all alone, if there's something you'd want to say. Maybe you're nervous to talk in front of a big group. Is there a noise you can make? To let me know you're here. Anything at all, if you want to knock on the wall, if you want to whisper, move something. Can you repeat the sound? I keep, I don't know if it's just like me shifting or I feel like I keep hearing something right next to me on the wall. Yeah. That is so nice. Yes. Wow. They have an AM. Oh, we also free of charge have a tendency to plug the living crowd out. <laughs> Yeah. So this was the old Norwich Bulletin, and they just told us that these three pipes here still have ink in them. It's super cool. Did you go in?